Hi and welcome to Resetpedia. Today I am going to be showing you how to do a hard reset factory store password wipe on your Apple iPod Touch. Okay, what I got right here is a screen that says iPhone is disabled. Try again in 2 million, uh, 22 million. Uh, 436,838 minutes which is basically meaning you're pretty much locked out now this is the fourth generation iPod touch however this method will work with uh, any other generation okay so if you're, uh, if you're locked out you're disabled you forgot your password um, it's not the end of the world and um, you could do this yourself at home okay so, first thing we want to do is we want to plug this into iTunes, okay? I'll go ahead and uh, plug my device in iTunes here. Okay, so iTunes, once you plug it into iTunes, it's going to basically uh, say it's locked with a password. Um, it won't be able to help you if you have a password lock. So we could just, uh, you know, I mean, close this little dialog box here. But what we're going to need to do, we open, as soon as we plug it in, iTunes will pop up. Okay, make sure we got the latest iTunes. So on our device, still going to say the same thing, but here is where you want to pay attention very carefully. Okay, so watch the buttons that I'm about to press, okay? And we're going to have to enter the um, iPod Touch into uh, DFU mode, which is a mode which uh, we need to be in to restore the device. So we want to press and hold the uh, power button, and then press and hold the... Uh, Wait, okay, make sure it's on. Press and hold the uh, home button. Press and hold the power button at the same time. Keep on holding it until it blacks out. So it blacked out. It'll make a sound on your computer. Count to three. One, two, three. Let go of the power button, but hang on to the home button. And you hang on to the, you know, I mean, this home button until basically iTunes uh, reads your device. And it will say on your screen, iTunes has detected an iPod in recovery mode. You must restore this iPod before it can be used with iTunes. So that's the message that you want. So you click OK. And you just hit restore. Of course you have to be on Wi-Fi to do this. Check my Wi-Fi settings. Okay, so in order to make this work, you have to log into your Wi-Fi, have to have internet access, and then all you do is just hit restore. And it's asking you, are you sure you want to restore and update your device? Yes, restore and update, click that. And it's going to take you to the latest uh, firmware. Just click next, agree. And that's pretty much it. If you haven't already downloaded the latest firmware, it will um, automatically download the latest firmware for you. So there's nothing else to do but uh, kick back, uh, relax, and just wait. Have a little patience. Um, it will take a little while. Maybe it depends on the uh, speed of your um, internet and uh, how fast you download the, uh, the uh, software. Okay, guys, if you guys found this tutorial helpful, um, Give me a thumbs up, a like, uh, subscribe to Resetpedia. Okay, thank you for watching.